All right, guys, before we get into the video, I have a couple things that I just wanted to throw out there real quick. So if you guys want to catch them or throw them right back, you can do that as well. But I have a Discord, and I would love for you guys to come join it. Links will be down in the description. The reason I'm shouting that out, because yesterday's video was an awesome video. I got to play a little bit of Fight Club with a lot of my subscribers and people that I've been friends with for a while. And we got on Xbox and really just tore it up. And uh, we have people in there all the time looking for players to play with so if you have ps4 or you have xbox it doesn't matter if you want to hook it up on red dead redemption 2 online then we got people there for you so uh come on and join in we got a lot of people there it's very active so come in uh check it out and uh, i bet you won't regret it but uh yeah check that out and also if you haven't followed my twitch go ahead and do that too because that's where we stream all the fun stuff so i'll see you guys later What's going on, everybody? Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. It's your boy Abe Lincoln here, aka D4, but you guys can call me really whatever you like. Uh, today, I got a little XP freaking video for you. Actually, it's a money XP slash little everything. It's everything, pretty much. I, I don't know how else to tell you, but it's a little everything. We're going to call in my horse, Nightmare. Come on over here, Nightmare. But uh, if you guys haven't been enjoying this channel, I don't know what the crap you'll want from me. Because I'm bringing everything and anything I can get my hands on to you guys first. Now, here we go. So, what we're going to do is we are in the sleepy, lovely town of Valentine. Met this girl in Valentine. Like to drink that fancy wine. Alright, we're going to be going out towards this way. Um, we have a doctor in the building. Because we are going to be looking for herbs. Now, herbs are really, really not that hard to find. But there seems to be an abundance of them outside of Valentine I have found. I don't know if anybody else has found this. But I have figured it's going to be an easy way to get some decent XP. So, here's what you do. You go outside of Valentine. You get off your horse right here. This is the spot. And once you get out of Valentine, you just hit in on both of your joysticks. Once you do that... You're going to be able to find herbs. Once you find some herbs, hold on, let me get some here. Oh, there they are. Okay, they're everywhere. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to eat one of them and then pick up the rest. Eat one because that is also a challenge if you eat different kinds of them. So I ate a little bit of time, and I'm going to pick up the rest of the time, you know? Um, so that's what you're going to do. We're going to pick up as many as we can, eat one, then pick up the rest. Eat one, pick up the rest. I'm going to eat one just to show you guys. Uh, what exactly you need to do when it comes to that, but I'm gonna show you how many freaking things are here It's like a crap ton. There's so many different herbs here um, So again, we're gonna eat one pick up one eat one pick up one But I don't know if a lot of you guys have actually been doing this a lot with your characters I know I haven't at all. I just been like ignoring them all together and <laughs> I was like, oh, yeah, that's actually a thing we could do. And you can actually reset this one, too. So this is something you can reset once you get all the challenges done. Now, it's going to take you a little time to do it. Um, but it's not as bad as, like, grinding other things. I mean, it's pretty safe. I mean, I could have someone just kill me. But it seems like people that are around Valentine really aren't that hostile, I have found. Um, we, of course, you're going to have your person every once in a while, especially around the butcher. If you're carrying, you know something that's really rare on your back, uh, then, yeah, they're going to probably try to tackle you for it. Um, but as you run around here, you should be able to find more. Let's see if we can find more here. Uh, I'm straight up missing some. I'm probably running right by some, but it seems to all be in a little jog distance from each other. Let's see here. Oh, yeah, I got some over here. All right, so boom, bam, bop. All right, what is this? It's the flowers. Okay, so I'm going to pick up... Oh, it's wild carrots, actually. Okay, cool. So... Pick up one, put one in my pocket. Pick up one, and eat one as well. So it's pretty, it's like I said, it's pretty simple to do this stuff. It's really not that hard. Like, you could teach your little brother to do this and give him like a dollar. And he could go around and get you some major XP from basically doing nothing. <laughs> so again, pick up one, eat one. Pick up one, eat one. And uh, once we get enough... There we go. I got 50 herbs right there. It's got 105 XP for picking up 50 herbs. Like, it took me no time to pick up 50 herbs. And then I also got a survivalist award as well on top of that. Um, but, yeah, I'm going to show you exactly what they got involved in all this in just a second once we go to the doctor. 
Um, and also, like, since you're, like, running around and doing stuff, what I tend on tend to do is to, you know, get out my gun, and if I see any wildlife, usually there's some wildlife running around these trees over here. Actually, is that something right there? No, it's not. I thought that was some kind of flower. I was like, oh, what? But I know there's some flowers and stuff around here. All right. So let's see if we can find any animals. Usually there's some around these trees. For whatever reason, I've found animals over here. Oh, there's one. There's a squirrel. Which is, you know, nothing. But let's say that you find an animal while you're doing this. You can also pick those up and, you know, get a little chain for those too. Head on to the butcher when you're doing that. But, um, yeah, so as soon as you have stuff, and there it goes. Oh, there's a fox. And I should have shot him, but I was too slow. Um, get our horse over here. Once we get my horse, Nightmare. All right, Mr. Nightmare. Take me to the promised land. And I don't actually want to get these real quick. I don't want to pass those up. Because, I mean, we're trying to get to 100. That's where the bigger XP is. And then, of course, your 250s and your 500 range. So the more we can get, the better. But after you've eaten one of them, um, you don't have to eat them again. You don't have to eat. But if you're doing it for the first time... Then definitely uh, eat one, then pick up two. Eat one, pick up two. Because if you eat more than one, it doesn't count towards your total. You have to eat 20 different ones to unlock that that first unlock there. So that's what we're doing with that. Um, so as we run in, hopefully these guys don't kill me. These guys seem cool. And we're going to run by, go to the doctor. Which is really nice that it's right here. Which is the main reason this is a quick way I'm doing stuff. And this is getting a little hectic around here. Alright, so doctor's right here. Right where it says drugs. Hop off our horse. Run into the drugstore. Once you get here, you want to talk to this man right here. Sell. And once you sell, that is also one of the uh, things you can do. So I want to sell all. There's five of those there. I want to sell all of these. Five of those. Want to sell all of those, two of those, and two of these. And I got 158 XP because I think I unlocked something. Let's see what I unlocked. Yes, trade herbs. So I got XP for trading. I got XP for picking them up. And you can also get XP from... And these guys are yelling. Okay. You can also get XP from eating them. So let's go over to survivalist, and it shows you exactly. So I can actually... Get these and reset these. After I get all the way through and get the buckle award, I can reset these after getting a thousand, which is nice because that's an easy upgrade. Um, I've tasted five out of twenty. So once you get, <laughs> I got you. Once you get five, uh, after I get fifteen more, I get a, a belt buckle award for that. And then you can do for crafting and then also learning the crafts. Um, but these are the two that I'm more worried about: eating them and picking them up, but you can get them also from selling as well. Um, but yeah, that's what I just wanted to show you guys, that it was super easy and super simple to do that. Um, but yeah, I've already got three item shops. I mean, that's pretty easy. Uh, you cannot reset this award, which is nuggets. And then we have a spin cash in shops, all the other stuff. But visit, what was that? Vi visit 50 shops. Okay, I haven't visited 50 shops yet. But uh, let's see here. Valuables to offense. Doctor, here it is. Okay, so I've sold 54 out of 50 items. 75, I get another bump upgrade. And I could probably do that in one sitting. And then also I get an upgrade at 100. That belt buckle award is going to be super easy to get. And I'm not sure if you can reset that one, but I know for sure you can reset the herb one. So if you want to check that out, definitely do so. But anyways, guys, that is the end of this video. Thank you guys for coming along and checking out this video with me. The XP is great. The money is decent. And uh, just getting some things out of the way is also a great thing. Oh, my God. It is mayhem in here. I'm going back inside the store. I don't need to be outside. Jesus Christ. But if you guys would, leave a like on the video. Also, make sure you subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys next time. I love you, and have a great day. See you guys. Peace out. That's it. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to shoot somebody. What is, what's going on? It's, it's getting too crazy up here, guys. Listen. Listen, buckaroos. Listen, buddy. Oh, no. He's going to kill me. I don't get over this fence. Oh, he's he's down on the ground. He's down. He's dead. Ah, yeet. Run. <laughs> Run. His boys are coming. Oh, there's a guy right here. Yeah, yeah, yeet. Ah. Everybody's freaking out now. I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. Oh, this guy's got the dual pistols. Good for that guy. Jesus Christ. 
All right, guys.